Hey guys, Migs here. And yeah, I decided to edit this vlog finally. This is actually my trip in last month, climbing the third highest mountain in the Philippines, which is Mount Pulag. It's actually the highest peak in Luzon as well. So yeah, without further ado, I'll just share it with you. Um, just a warning, this is going to be a very, very long vlog. So yeah, see you on the next clips. <laughs> So good morning. Shut up. So we're actually right now here in Nua, Baguio. Just so you know, I've been staying here. Just so you know, I've been staying here for like a week already. Tapos this week, and I plan to to go to Bulan. Um, so right now, our call time is at 4 a.m. here in. Victory Liner near the PNR in Baguio sa may Caltex. And yun, I don't know what to say. I mean, I want to vlog. I want to document this trip. Kasi wala lang. I think it's my first time doing it. I mean, I, I went to Mount Pinatubo na rin. But if ever. Para, this is my first parang totoong mountain mountain ganun. So, for those who don't know, Mount Pulag is the third highest mountain in the Philippines. It's the highest peak in Luzon. So, medyo, I don't know what to expect. I mean, I, I expect it super big daw kasi umaabot. Lalo na, the biggest months, umaabot daw ba ng 0 to, yeah, 2 to 3 degrees, parang ganun. So, yesterday, I prepared, I bought much thicker jacket, um, appropriate pants, hindi lang for trekking but for the cold weather too. Ano pa ba? Um, yep, three layers of clothes kasi that's what they advise. So I hope this trip is gonna be number one safe and yep, memorable for me. Sana memorable in a good way, not in a bad way. So yeah, um, come with me for this trip. And I don't know, it la away. And that's the intro. After that one, I didn't vlog anymore because it's a two hour drive and it's so dark. Super dilemma, wala din naman kayo makita. But after going there, we arrived at DNR. The next clip is gonna be in the DNR briefing already. Then after that, we are, we settled down to our homestay. And yeah, I'll just fast forward it to the actual hike that we did. It's around, we, we started around 12.30 a.m. And yeah, I'll just post a picture here before going to, DN, to the DENR headquarters, um, our stopover. So we stopped over because we were going to go, but yeah, let's proceed to the next clip. <laughs> Well, I said the pen. Yeah, after settling down or after lunch, we arrived around, we arrived around, um, let's just say around 10 a.m. in there, in the DNR. Tapos, after the briefing there, we went to our homestay already. Then after going to our homestay, we had lunch. And after lunch, around 1.30 or 2 p.m., I slept. I took a melatonin so that mataas yung tulog ko. Kasi before the trip, actually, wala akong tulog. So, yeah, um, nagising ako ng mga 6. I didn't vlog that anymore but we had dinner at 6 p.m. tapos I slept again I woke up around 11 30 p.m. then yeah it's we I don't know we got ready to to do the hike already so for the next clips it's the light breakfast that we had around 12 midnight so yeah I'll show you as well our rooms cinema kasama ko and fun fact May mga senior citizen ang kasama so look at the desk clip. <laughs>
Ito ito guys, light breakfast lang. Ito mga kasama ko. Si Doc. Ano yan eh? Mayamang pamilya, mayari ng hospital sa Pangasinan eh. Maraming ano, maraming natin. Hey, hi. Maraming kasi yung ano, maraming. I thought this is my room. Bago ligo yan. Hi ulit. Hi. Hello. Tu yang pemayaman yang anu. Tibo. So I don't know if kita nyawa kau buat. Kita na. Now here sa jump jump off area. So kita climb nak kami starting. Anu arus lah. Anu arus lah lek jad. Kurang. 1.15, gano'n, mga 1.15 So, tingnan natin kung time tayo maka, makakapunta sa Camp 1, Camp 2, Camp 3, tapos summit Let's go! And story time, when we started the hike, the weather is really good um, And how can I, how can we gauge if it's really good or not? So, yung driver, na, yung driver namin of the van na pumunta sa Pulag every day or every week, I don't know Nag-decide siya pumunta doon because um, He thought that the weather is really good because you can see all the stars. It's like the you, you know you can see the universe. So that means once we arrive at the peak, there's gonna be clearing. So clearing means you know there's a sea of clouds and everything. But everything started to fall apart. And when we when we were on our way to Camp Two, dona so mulang umulan. So that's why it's really advisable as well to bring a raincoat or like a poncho. And yeah, so kaya hindi ko rin nalabas yung camera ko most of the time because it's it's raining as well and my DJI Pro Pocket is not um water resistant as well. So yun. So the next clips is actually our um clips na on Camp 2 which we um rested for a while and see what happens because nga hindi lang umulan guys bumagyo so everyone who's on the top yung mga nagka-camp sa taas pinababa you can see that uh, you can see it on the clips in there later too so yun um another story time later <laughs> just watch this clips first punta na kami sa tower tower tayo pupunta no okay so medyo malipis sa yung oxygen dito after the tower After the sunrise, we'll transfer to the summit if if the weather permits. Sana, sana Lord please. So sila, pumunta silang summit but they're asked to go down kasi di good yung weather today. So kaya sana after the tower, maging okay na. And yeah, after tumambay sa camp 2 ng around 1 hour and 30 minutes, we had a regrouping happened so tinanong ni Moy sinong gustong tumuloy at sinong hindi gustong tumuloy because yun nga bumabagyo like guys super lakas ng ulan talaga um originally we were just third we, we were 30 parang 15 per van kasi dalawang van yung group namin the other van na rinig ko hindi sila tutuloy lahat kasi ayo tumuloy ng tour guide nila for just just for safety with us Moy asked us sinong gustong tumuloy and over 30 only six of us decided to push through kasi number one ayoko nang bumalik it's just a one 
one time one life experience for me once in a lifetime experience for me and yon um medyo humina rin kasi ulan kaya naging mas, mas parang okay lang for us tumuloy but later let's see what will happen hey na hey guys welcome to mr again <laughs> So after a like parang one hour break kasi nga umulan it rained super lakas everyone in the sound was asked to go down <sighs> tuloy na we're going to the summit three hours na lang and let's see this is it right now runny nose meron and i think you will feel na numbumpis talaga yung oxygen pero yun ano lang, one thing I learned in this trek number one, patient is a virtue number two patient is a virtue pa rin kasi pag hindi namin ito hinintay hindi kami abot ng summit kasi yung mga kasama namin naghintay kanina yun, bumaba na hanggang camp 2 lang sila sa amin nababalik na daw sila fun fact, hindi na ako babalik so push talaga natin yung summit <sighs> ano kasama ko and here's the view ayun na, malapit na <sighs> hindi ko ba, dalhin nyo ba yung hingal, hindi hingal yun wala talagang oxygen masyado pero sabi ng DNR kaya naman daw so push lang oh stop over t-shirt ka dali stop over kami dito kasi there's a good spot tapos sagay ko na lang shot ko dito okay let's go nakasama ko rin yan, joiner din yung kagaya ko Andiyan taga sa nga ulit? Lucena Lucena Masa sila taga? Jupiter yata Taga Jupiter ba kayo? Ah, Mercury pa Ah, Mercury pa lang Sa Mercury maraming buntis, di ba? Ayaw, Mercury pa Ate niya, taga Mercury Ang anak lang So, super bilis ng Super lakas ng hangin 
super lakas ng hangin ngayon I don't know if you hear it but in, for me the feeling is you know you know the feeling pag you're in a car tapos open windows tapos tumatakbo yung car yun yun yung feeling imagine ganun ka lakas kahit hindi kami tumatakbo so let's go ito hindi ka sa loobo pa hi po good morning Ingat din po <laughs> Morning So yun, kanina yung mga nakasalubong kami <laughs> Hindi ko na pinakita but uh, Yun, di sila tuloy Kasi grabe nga yung hangin sa yung lamig Just dito In Pulag, just so you know Umaabot na 2 to 3 degrees Celsius So Yun, baka hindi nila kinaya <laughs> Ingat po. Sige, hindi ba sa amin. Just go Lord. Sino mo nagplano nito? Miguel, bakit ka mong punta dito? Hindi ako nagka-gloves kasi hindi makapitan ng mga cellphone But, kaya lapit na 30 minutes na lang daw Pero the past 2 hours yan kasi nasabi na nakapit sa lupa ng 30 minutes So, hindi nakapit na dito yung alas 30 minutes kami in total anim na lang kami aakyat dito sa summit so if you're asking how uh, how cold gano'ng kalamig here look nag ice na yung mga flowers so gano'n 5 minutes na lang daw sana totoo Uh, pero just for the record mas napagod pa ako ng mga pinatubo trip ko kesa ngayon kasi siguro dahil of the weather mas malamig yun and yun Guys, extreme and done. Wala pa sa peak. But, huh, wala na oxygen. But ito na. Ito na. Ito na. Ito na. Ito na. Ito na. So after from the peak siguro mga 3 to 4 hours we're now here back in Camp 1 So ito yung first stop earlier na hindi ko na bilinag because madilim So yep From here Camp 1 to the homestay Let's just say mga 20 to 
uh, 30 to 45 minutes depende gano'ng kabilis but yun um gabi umuulan nag nag coat na kami basang basa pati bre bye bye and yeah I was just so happy that we arrived again at camp 2 kasi number 1 hindi siya madali guys bagyo kung nakita niyo yung 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 videos kanina di ba hindi ka nag nag fast forward and also um yun when we arrived at camp 2 there's another 3 hours hike going down I mean walking going down again 3 to 4 hours going to the base camp and yeah I just want to have this opportunity to to say thank you to the Lord that I'm still alive kasi hindi madali guys it's it's not just rain it's a bagyo and also I gained an experience you know ako nag take risk talaga I don't know what will happen in there but I decided to push through and um I didn't regret doing that one so yeah, uh, I think the next tip is just the outro of this video, but thank you for staying and watching this video. So, we're here sa home sena. We arrived around 1, so we started around 1. We arrived around 1. That's if you go to the summit. So, so yun. Sarap yung pagkain. We're just preparing to leave this place na tapos we'll go to the ENR to get our certificates <sighs> I think it's nice sharing with you this um, trip but I don't know this is my first time so I'll be not to bye guys <laughs> Ha ha ha! Ano, ano? Tukot ka pa ng apple next month!